buddy quest wise here about a month ago I put up a video about how much I love dungeon crawl classics and about my idea for heavy metal weekends well about a week ago they sent me some goodies I'm going to show that to you now let's head on down to the table take a look okay well here we are at the table first things first check out this beautiful play mat here I uh picked this up uh I've shopped with this guy before a few times I met him at a local uh, comic book convention here in town, comic book pop culture convention, called Cherry Capital Comic Con, and uh, he does some amazing, amazing artwork. His name is Nolan Nasir, and Nassar, I'm sorry Nolan if I get your name wrong, <clears throat> but I've got a couple playmats by him, and they're all just extremely, extremely gorgeous. This one's called The Library, and uh, if you'd like a copy or if you'd like to get a, a version of this as well as child, well let's check out all his other stuff. I'm put his card there for you so you can check out his website. Amazing guy, very very fair prices. Uh, great great stuff. If you're into play mats for anything, I use mine a lot of times for role playing. Uh, but if you're using uh, play mats for anything like Magic, The Gathering, or any other kind of card games, Nolan Germain, so go check him out there. There's his web address right there. Check out his stuff and pick up a copy for yourself. But that's not the main reason we're here for today. Today, uh, a few a few days ago, I got some really, really cool stuff in from Goodman Games. And it's a catalog of all their new stuff coming out for 2017, 2018. First thing in the inside, when I open it up, a lot of great stuff in here. I got this really kick-ass poster which will be going up on my wall here in the game room as soon as this video is over. But really, really cool poster. It's kind of big. I can't even fit it on the frame. It's a really cool poster in that. It also came with, because I'm part of the road crew, or part of the band, as they say, they also sent me one of these to put up in my local game store as well and put the location and date and time of uh, any games I'll be running uh, at whatever particular store. And I can hang that up in their window uh, as well. Um, especially, now this is really great too. If you're part of the road crew um, or part of the band, I keep saying the road crew, but it's, it's actually called part of the band. Um, you can make photocopies of this and do it. You can do numerous different locations. What I really love, here's the catalog cover. Catalog is amazing as well too. What I really love about Goodman Games, sorry, I've got this new rig here and it's still a little... Still playing around with it a little. It's a little wobbly. I apologize for any shakiness that's going on here. What I really love about Goodman Games is their attention to detail. They are probably one of the best companies I've ever, role playing game companies I've ever had a chance to work with that really, really value their, their players, the people who purchase their stuff. And this company just does some amazing, amazing things. You can sign up to play their, or to run their games for them, to demo their stuff for them, to introduce new people to their systems for free. And the more that you do it, the more times that you actually play the game, the more times that you actually share this with other people, the more cool stuff you get. So, for instance, I've done a few games so far. I've got an amazing uh, chunk of... Uh, bookmarks i've gotten pins i've gotten uh, excuse me <coughs> i've gotten um a player character sheets uh, all sorts of great stuff and the more and more you do uh the more stuff you get and, and it'll show it some of the stuff at you in here but uh this was a catalog that was given out to all the people who are part of the band part of the band and it's all the amazing stuff that's coming up as far as like adventures and not just for Dungeon Crawl Classics, but also for anything that's Goodman Games related. I just wanted to give you a little flip through, show you what's available, show you what kind of great stuff that these guys do, and hopefully get you on band on, on the band as well too to check out some stuff. Another one thing I want to point out to you, any game companies who might be watching my videos, anybody who might be listening, do you want to make your your role playing game successful? Do you want to make your role-playing game super awesome make it collectible goodman games has done something amazing and i'll show you inside here what they've done 
They've written numerous adventures for Dungeon Crawl Classics. They've done numerous, not editions, but printings of, of Dungeon Crawl Classics. And they've done them with collectible covers. So the adventure, the, the actual, you know, the meat of the stuff is still the same. But the covers are collectible and they're different. And there's some sketch covers. There's some variant art covers and stuff. If you're a comic book collector, you know exactly what I'm talking about. This is the way to do a role-playing game. If you really want it to make it sort of a pop culture icon, make your game collectible. So let's take a look inside and see what we got here. Inside the front cover here, we've got the Dungeon Crawl. I apologize for the glare here. Maybe I can fix this. Let's see what I can do about the glare. It's making it worse. Let's see. Uh... I guess I can't get rid of it entirely, but you get the gist here. Here's a couple. This is the original cover here. There's a variation cover here. There's a couple other variant covers as well. If you haven't tried Dungeon Crawl Classics, I highly, highly recommend it. It is amazing. Or if you just want to go over and take a look, I'll post, post a link in the, uh, the notes below. But if you want to take a, take a look at my, my review of Dungeon Crawl Classics and my idea for Heavy Metal Weekends, uh, check that out and you'll, you'll, you'll find out some more. Here's a, a, a page full of classic adventures that they've produced, as well as some great variant covers on some of those as well. Some more classic adventures. Um, some of these are box sets, so Parallel and the Purple Planet is a box set. You can get those individually as well, too. Uh, over here it talks about the multiple printings and it talks about how the, you know the, the judges screen and how um, How the printings work and stuff on the different variations so not different editions of the game So Dungeons and Dragons is in its fifth edition fifth editions of its rule set Dungeon Crawl Classics is still using the same rule set, but it's on its fourth printing now again variant covers uh, artist editions for different adventures uh, limited edition covers again I guys Goodman games thank you so much <laughs> as a as a collector and as a as a person that's a kind of a collector nerd um, this is genius I think this is brilliant to, to have uh, collectible covers um, I'm, a, I'm a sucker for it and uh, I think a lot of people else are as well too classic box sets dungeon crawl classics classic box sets uh, nice great great stuff there a variant covers on those as well and then now they don't all do just uh, just DCC. They do have some uh, compatible products as well. So there's Mutant Crawl Classics, which is a new version, sort of like uh, Metamorphosis Alpha, if you've ever played that at all. Of course, Lankmar, uh, which is a Fritz Lieber thing. Amazing, amazing stuff there. These guys are all do really, really great stuff. Love the 1970s art style. Now, Dungeon Crawl Classics does use a variant of the traditional role-playing dice. It does use its traditional seven dice, but it also uses uh, other dice in there as well, too. And what the genius thing about Dungeon Crawl Classics is is that it uses, instead of doing a bunch of modifiers uh, for dice rolling, it uses a dice chain, so it starts at the lowest of, like, a D4. And every time you would get a modifier in what a normal, like, D&D &D game, you simply go up in a die level. So you're going to have weird dice in here like a D7 and a D14 and a D16 and a D30. Um, so you don't you don't need them. They tell you in the book uh, how to use a regular set of dice to do these. But uh, definitely helpful if you do have some there. And they do have variations of those dice as well too. Uh, if you're interested in Metamorphosis Alpha, a bunch of great stuff there. Um, this is the classic original edition and that I just mentioned a minute ago. Uh, it's very similar to like mutant crawl classics and stuff as well too. So science fiction, mutant animals and creatures, and then Judges Guild, which is some amazing products as well. These are reprints of stuff that you can get from them, and then they also do some fifth edition stuff as well too. So if you're a fifth edition fan of D and D, um, they do some some adventures that are that use that rule set, as well as Age of Cthulhu, uh, which is licensed by Chaosium, which is very very nice. And the best thing, another great thing about Goodman Games, the t-shirts, man. These things are fantastic. These things are awesome. Still have yet to get my hands on the co or one of these at all. Um, but I, I, mean, I really love the logo and stuff with DCC. 
and uh, I would totally sport a 1970s style uh, role-playing t-shirt. Uh, come some other cool stuff that they do as well too. There's a free RPG Day products, some convention releases that you can only get through some certain conventions, and appendix and reprints. These are stories that were told, uh, talked about in the original D and D appendix N, and they've gone out of their way to do some reprints of those, so that you can enjoy that and find out what really inspired the original D and D and stuff. On the back here, it talks about the Road Crew. I guess it is called the Road Crew. I always thought it was called the Band. Anyhow. Here's how you can get involved. If you want to check that out, check them out down here at Goodman Games. It's www.goodman-games.com. Check them out. Uh, buy a copy of their book. It's amazing. Uh, I believe you can get it in hardcover and paperback. And there should be a couple different variations on that cover as well, too. But please check out their book. Uh, if you love that sort of 1970s heavy metal, crazy, over-the-top adventure, you're going to love DCC. And uh, then once you do, once you get a couple games under your belt, join the road crew and you can get some amazing stuff. The top coveted prize every year is the belt buckle. Um, still yet to get one of those, but I uh, would love some, love some dice bags or something as well too. So great, great stuff for today. That's going to be about it. Just wanted to show you the cool stuff that you can get from Goodman Games and how wonderful that they are to their players and their fans. So until next time, I'm QuestWise and we're out.